morning. It's currently half five. Five thirty-six. Um don't really sleep very well. So I just thought I'd get up, start my uni work. Um but I'm just going to do like an in-depth what I eat in a day today. Just like I always do them on my my Instagram feed, but like I never do like a proper in-depth like what I actually eat and just like how like I make my meals and like my snacks and stuff. So yeah, oh, I'm so tired, but let's get into it. I normally um don't eat for like a few hours when I get up just because I eat quite late at night. Not late at night, but like I'll have like a snack at like just before I go to bed. So I wake up and I'm like not really hungry and I don't really like eating first thing in the morning. Anyway, so I normally just have a coffee and start my uni work and then have my oats like after I've been up for like a few hours. But that's just my preference. I'm gonna make my coffee out. I'm being so loud. I feel like my mum and dad probably think that we're getting burgled, but it's just me and the dog. So yeah, hope you all enjoy. So if you know from my Instagram stories, you know that I always have these my protein flavor drops, just the peanut butter ones. Um, I don't like my coffee too sweet. I say that as I've just added about twenty drops. Um, and then I drink my coffees with either oat or coconut milk. Um, I just add voila, stunning, and that just gets me going set up for the day. So yeah. I'm gonna sit and do uni work for a few hours. I feel like I'm gonna hit a wall at like 10 a.m. and I really don't know why I'm awake right now, but my body clock wakes me up at like five, six in the morning because I go to bed so early. But yeah, I'm just gonna sit and do uni work now. Hey. Say hey. Uh, but yeah, hope you all have a good Monday. Millie has just started barking. I think she saw a cat and started barking. And another dog in the street joined in. It's literally quarter to six and I've just set all the dogs out barking in the street Um, so if mum and dad you're watching this and you're probably awake right now I apologise Um, if you've just been woken up by about ten dogs barking it's, so it's now half seven um, and I'm going to lectures and I'm just gonna make my breakfast now because I'm starting to get hungry and I want a break because I'm getting bored of doing my uni, so I'm just gonna show you my oats that I make every single morning without fail, and they're so good. So I'll show you how I make. So I started actually making my oats in a pan. I used to do it in the microwave, and then Steph started doing it in a pan, and it's so much better in a pan. So it's like so much thicker and just overall better. So I get oats, and I always do either forty or fifty grams. I'm gonna do 50 this morning because I'm quite hungry, just depending on how hungry I am. Um, so 50 grams of oats, just like any oats. And then I get protein powder, my protein, chocolate brownie. Don't even need to say anymore because it's honestly just the best thing. And then I put 25 grams of protein powder in with that. Is that 26? So I'm not like strict, like it needs to be that's 28 so I'm just going to take a tiny bit now. Um, so 25. So it looks like so. And then I'll add like however much water just um, so it kind of looks like that. And then I just mix it together so it kind of so like forms like it kind of looks like oats but not really. I always have like my caffeine intake is like horrific but I'll normally have like my second coffee with my breakfast and then I try and save myself to like, if I'm training, I'll save myself to have like a pre-workout. So like a Monster or a coffee shop in Costa. Because even if I have, I can't take caffeine past 3 p.m. And when I lie in my bed at night, I literally will get heart palpitations, which is obviously not ideal, but um, yeah. So just got my oats heating. I'm just gonna put my, ingredients away so, I'm on, so my mum doesn't shout at me. I always put it on far too hot and then it ends up like burning the pan but I like it to be like piping hot and then I've just got the coffee machine back on for my second coffee but yeah normally just mix for like two to three minutes until it's like so thick enough. It should look like that and then I'm just gonna get a bowl and add honestly the same and then just start adding my toppings of chocolate. Can you put a pan down on that? 
Can you put a pot pan on glass? Yeah, surely, because you can put an oven tray. So, get a bowl. And then I'll show you what toppings I'm going to cut up this. Misfits cookies and cream protein bar. Let it sit on the top and add some peanut butter. Um, that's all I normally add to my oats in the morning. Sometimes I add fruit or just like whatever I have. But yeah, I'm going to add a protein bar and peanut butter this morning. Mm. So that's my finish. Out. I added five grams of this peanut butter. Just I literally add whatever peanut butter I have. And then just a little iced coffee again with the, my protein drops. So yeah, I'm going to sit and chill for a bit, watch some YouTube and eat this and then I'll get back to my So on my way to the gym now and I'm having a protein bar. I'm not hungry but I planned a big session so I know that I need more fuel and I'm just going into the co-op to get a white monster as my pre-workout as well. So yeah, I'm just having that. So just a, my protein protein bar and a white monster. white monster. Um, so I got this. I feel like this is extreme goth behaviour. It's a mango flavour, so shall I try it? Um, I'm really not hungry, but I know I need to eat that protein bar because I'm going to be in the gym for like an hour and a half. And Oh, that's actually really nice. I recommend. So I'm going to drink that on the way to the gym and eat my protein bar. And then, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. So 11.51, I've just trained. I did um, a 15 minute warm up on the bike. Two 20 minute circuits non stop, like two hits, um, some calf raises, some rehab stuff on my foot, and then just five minutes on the cross trainer. So, yeah, I'm pooped. I think me and my mum are gonna go for coffee now, and then, yeah, I'll show you my lunch. And me stuff. and mum are gonna go for a coffee, and um, so I'm gonna have my lunch when I'm back, and I'm just gonna have a banana right now, but they look kind of green, which is kind of mag. But it's either that or that, so I'll just go with right. But yeah, I'm going for coffee, so just another banana as a snack. So I'm gonna add that into my fitness. So I'm gonna make my lunch now, and I'm going to have some. That is the most annoying thing um, ever. Oh my god, the noise in this house. I'm gonna make 13 pancakes. So I use uh, my protein pancake mix and I use 50 grams of that and then I just add water and put it on a pan. I might just do 40 grams. I'm just going to do 40 grams. Um, but yeah, I just need for coffee. So I normally have for like lunch, I'll have like pan protein pancakes or like avocado on toast or eggs. Um, but yeah, just add water and then I cook them, so I'll show you that. Mm -hmm. I don't really mix that very well, so it's kind of lumpy. I also think I've added too much water because it looks really lumpy, so sometimes my pancakes look good and I feel like today when I'm actually showing you them, they're going to end up looking shit, but yeah. It's so quick to make, so that's why sometimes I just don't... Yeah, these really don't look good, but... Trust the process. So I finished making my pancakes. I'm actually ashamed to show them because they look that horrific. Um, and then I normally just add the my protein. I'm not even going to show you my. I'll show you them really quickly. But they normally look good and they look horrendous. But I think there's like um. Let me just check how many grams of protein is in this. So no. 32 grams of protein altogether and only 190. Else. so that is my lunch I'm not i'm actually ashamed like it looks horrendous it normally looks nice but i think i added too much water in it and it just like didn't when i was like trying to cook it it was just like liquid so it was all just breaking up but i'm still gonna eat it um so it's quarter past three and they'll probably have my dinner at like six so yeah. so i just had an unintentional to around that but that's only waking up at a half past five um, so it's now 10 to 6 and I think I'm going to start making dinner because do you mind? Because I'm hungry. So I'm not planning on having for dinner. I'm just going to eat whatever's there. So let's see what we can put together. I'm just going to put on some calamari with 
some Mexican rice and then just some vegetables. I've got a spot, I'm actually sore. So I'm just going to put that on. Did anyone else not know that there's like loads of protein in calamari? Obviously that's stupid because calamari is fish, so there's obviously going to be protein. But I scanned it the other day and it was like 25 grams of protein or something. And I was like, whoa. So I'm just going to add some soy sauce and heat the rice and my veg. And what are you making for dinner? Uh, chicken strips and potato wedges and veg. We don't have any. Veg. We're using the new air fryer. We've got an air fryer, so Steph's trying that out. But I want my food now, so I'm just gonna heat my rice and then my calamari's in the oil. This is the finished product. It looks really unappetizing, but there's 23 grams of protein and it's just rice, veggies, and calamari. So yeah, I'm just gonna eat that. Um, so I'm just going to have a cookie now for dessert and I'm going to heat it up in the microwave and then I'll probably put either peanut butter or like Nutella or something on top of it. So yeah. I'm going to put some of this spread on it. It's like white chocolate and it's literally the best thing. How good is this spread? How good is this spread? Yeah guys, spread is so good! Oh my god, you're so <laughs> annoying. So I'm just going to sit and eat this and then I'm going out with my friends for a wee bit. Um, I've still got calories left that I can have, so I maybe have like a little snack or like a yogurt or something when I'm in. I've been a bit cautious of like putting like calories of like what I'm eating because like I know it can be like triggering and like some people can like get like triggered by that. But like um, the stuff I eat is like what works for me. So I'm on like 2,000 to 2,300 calories and if I eat anything below that then I do lose weight so um but that's just like that works with like my exercise levels as well like obviously I train all the time um but yeah so just don't like compare what I eat to what you eat like I may eat more than you or maybe I eat less than you but that's just like what works for me so yeah I just wanted to say that quickly so I'm just in and it's 10 50 but I don't really feel like I need any more food like I feel full like satisfied um, so I've had 1,900 calories and 136 grams of protein. So that's just like a typical um, day of eating. I'm like not restrictive at all compared to what I used to be. Like I have like, I try and be like all round. Like I have like my fats, my proteins, my carbs. Uh, but yeah, and then I always usually like allow myself like at least one, like not like cheat meal, but like I'll always have like at least one takeaway, like like, like a Nando's or like a Domino's or something, just because like there's no need to like not like eat the foods you enjoy and like I enjoy those foods. So yeah, just thought um, if any of it's helpful, then feel free to save and copy my recipes. You can use my code MFIT, which gets you money off my protein if you saw any of the my protein products that you want but honestly my protein is like the best for food but yeah just again like don't compare to what I eat because that's what works for me that might not work for you but um yeah just have fun with it and find something that works for you and thanks again for if you've watched this far don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next week I'm actually so tired I've been up since five um so I might have a line tomorrow and then I'm going to hit legs at the gym tomorrow. But yeah, I'll see you next week.